Well, this is what I'm making today, my Tuscany um, pizza on Lazy Pizza Day in collaboration with Jan from Sushi Grill and Chill. He'll be making one uh, as well. Um, but for now, I'll get on with this one <laughs> um, because I'm very, very hungry. Hello and welcome to my cooking channel um, and and also from Sushi Chill and Grill um, we're doing a collaboration it's um, lazy pizza day uh, at the moment all I'm doing is making up the base to put on uh, my Tuscany pizza um, and then Jan will come along and do his lazy pizza and you'll have two pizzas for the price of one so let's get out to it um, all I'm going to do is chop this basil fresh basil, fresh oregano, fresh tomatoes and then I'm going to put them in a saucepan and simmer them for around about 20 minutes until they reduce down to a paste and then let them cool. Right, it is now assembly time. So this is my tomato base. This has got all the oregano and basil. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Yum, 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 yum. Right now, we've just got some Edam. I'm going to pop over there. Then we've got some strips of salami. Beautiful. So I've kept the flavours fairly simple. The only sort of, I think, breakaway <coughs> item that you'll see is really the um, <laughs> the feta cheese, which I quite like on pizza every now and again because it's got such a strong flavour. So, um, and this is all about uh, 
getting flavour, relaxing on a Sunday with a nice pizza. Okay. Gosh, that's a lot. <laughs> but that's okay. So now we're going to crumble some feta. Over there. Oh, always welcome. And once this is cooked, I will then put the avocado over the top. And there we are. Time to put this little baby into the oven. And there you have it, straight out of the oven. We're just going to put a little bit of avocado perfect now of course Jan will be making a another pizza on his channel um, on sushi grill and chill I will put the details of his channel in the description box below so that um, you can have a look at all the delicious things he has um, basically if you haven't got much time but you want flavor then he's your man so I'll just get this camera off the tripod And we can have a closer look and there you go looks beautiful doesn't it right let's get tucked in and I will catch you on the next recipe